Hello and welcome to another video. Uh, in this video I'm going to take a look at creating a simple keypad using uh, the template node in Node Red. Now I was asked a question a few weeks ago about is there a, a keypad node available in Node Red and I searched on the internet and I couldn't find one. So I thought I'd actually create one using the template node. So this is the keypad I've created. Now it's created out of a simple table and these here are table elements and just with numbers in I'll show you that in a second and so let's take a quick look at the the flow a very simple flow all you've got is a template node going into a debugger and this is there so we can see the output of the template node so if I open that up we have some styling at the top you can obviously make this much better than I've done this is very a uh, very quick demo and I'm not a a JavaScript front-end developer so my styling is not very good at all. Now all we've got down here is a table and we've got four rows in our table and these correspond obviously to these four here and we've got three columns over here and you can see here we've got three columns here with the uh, table elements and all we've got in these columns here is we've got a Angular command which basically sends a payload and if I click on this button here the one in the top left it sends the payload of one that one sends two that one sends three and we continue down until the end with the the hash now obviously we could make this this is a four by three table we could make it a four by four table simply by adding another element in here I just copy and paste that element and, and modify it so we can make this as, as wide and as uh, deep as, as we want to make it. So let's just uh, demonstrate how it works. So if I click on one, we can see one comes out of here. And if I click on the hash, we can see the hash comes out of here. So there is a very, very simple flow for key, uh, creating a keyboard. Now, if someone does come across a node that does this, then please let me know and uh, I'll maybe do a, a video on that. Okay, so that's the end of the video. If you like the video, then please click on the like button below. If you've got comments, then please leave them below. And if you want to get notified of new videos, then you can always subscribe to the channel. Until next time, goodbye.